not good morning. The sun's in the back, so you may not be able to see my face very well because of the sun. So we'll try to adjust a little bit in here. Um, I'm on my way to work. And uh, yeah, so it's Tuesday, September 27th. Where are they in September? So a friend of mine is getting married, and I'm trying to get a dress for the wedding. And I didn't realize how complicated that is. And, uh, yeah, so, I'm sure I don't get invited to weddings or things like that. And it's okay by me because I was like, eh, it's alright, you know. Um, but at the same time, it's like, I've been thinking about my life too lately. Like, it's just so many hours we spend at work so like 40 hours a week and then this and then taking care of trying to take care of myself you know it's it's just like I don't know and, and I'm not saying anything about my job I do like my job but I wish I could be doing something different like I could be doing something more creative it can get monotonous you know the whole day went yesterday like me doing crimson wires like it's it's alright, but at the same time, it's like, that's it, like, like, I don't know, like, I'd rather be doing something different with my life, but I realized that I need money to survive, and then it's like, think about, like, relationships and all that kind of stuff, like, I've been focused on wrestling most of the past few years, you know, and I haven't had time to go and date anyone like I've been I haven't gone dating I have stuck um, I've been trying online dating but I don't think it's working the way as it's supposed to and with work it's just like I don't know and it, it, it is one of those things and um, and I don't know why is it that it Finding people today is so difficult, but it is difficult for me. And um, but at the same time, I enjoy being single. You know, like I work on my own projects, I watch whatever I want, and Netflix. You know, when I want to, I go to a gym, I go to wrestling. It's easier, but at the same time, it's like I don't want to be alone for the rest of my life. I'm getting closer to the big five zero. The more I think about it, it's like, I really don't want to be alone for the rest of my life. Like, I really don't, honestly. I'm going to get old and, and like, like, not having somebody to share my life and, and to experience life and to have somebody that I can take care of and they can take care of me if something happens to me, like, this war is something, honestly. I, I don't know. Like, it's just me thinking about that, you know. Um, but at the same time, it's like, it, it is what it is. It's what I have. It's what I have learned to live with. And, you know, honestly, it doesn't bother me that much being single. Like I said, like, I do things on my own. I do go on with my life. I don't have to worry much about, like, what I think I need to be doing or what I think somebody else thinks that I should be doing, you know, um, and, but, it makes it a little bit difficult sometimes, I feel like, because everything I have to do myself, which makes sense, which makes sense, you know, like, it's part of being single, you do everything yourself, you know, like, you have to cook, you have to clean, you have to do this, and that, and that, and that, and sometimes there is very, as much as I want to have time to do a bunch of other stuff, Sometimes I don't have time because I have to spend time taking care of myself pretty much after work, you know. At work, they just want me to focus out about things at work, you know. And then at home, I have to focus on things at home. So, yeah. At some point, I would like to date again. I haven't dated in a while because I haven't feel like I'm ready again. Uh, especially, especially after the last breakup, you know. I did want on a date with somebody I met online, but things didn't work out. Um, but I haven't gone on a date, I think, since the pandemic started. I haven't, I haven't gone on a new 
anybody um, in person and I don't know if like long distance relationships work for me I don't think they work honestly especially if I don't see that person a lot it may they may work I don't know but I don't think they work for me I, I, I would like to meet people that live nearby that are close by closer you know and I don't know if it's been because I'm Puerto Rican so it makes the pool I feel like there are two factors that affect my dating pool one is the fact that I'm trans so meeting people that are okay with me being trans is one of those things um, the other factor is age I think after a certain age people tend to be settled down and so there's less people that is looking to date other people and then the final factor is that I'm Puerto Rican so finding people that are compatible with because yeah I'm nerdy on the kind of stuff but also I'm Puerto Rican I have my accent on the kind of stuff so finding somebody that would be okay dating me it's a little bit tricky um, and I'm saying that I would love I would prefer to date somebody that is Puerto Rican too. I have to admit it, you know. Um, I know, I will simplify the fact of having to explain um, my culture and all that kind of stuff. For somebody Hispanic, not necessarily Puerto Rican, but somebody Hispanic, I would be okay with that. Um, but it's, it's tough, honestly. And then, like, dealing with the fact that I don't fit the normal femininity, you know, like, and like lifting weights and all that kind of stuff. I don't, I don't know if that also counts against me. So I really don't know, and uh, that's making things, in my opinion, difficult to meet people online. And then with my wrestling life, you know, I spend a lot of time going to the gym, and like most of the time I spend by myself, you know, like. And yeah, I do watch other serious and all that kind of stuff but like I don't know I mean like I tend to be a very lonely person I'm okay I'm comfortable with my own skin like I don't need to depend on that relationship to feel fulfilled and feel happy and feel realized you know I don't need that and uh, I see sometimes uh, some people that I know going from like relationship to relationship to relationship and I don't know why it is, I get it that you don't want to be alone and that kind of stuff, but like when you feel like you need to depend on somebody to, to feel whole and complete and yada yada, I think it's a, a little bit too much. Maybe it's just my perspective, but like, I never have them. Do I know that I don't want to be alone? I don't feel like I need to be getting into a relationship with somebody because I need to feel complete. I don't need to feel complete to be in a relationship. I feel complete right now. I'm, I'm happy with life. I'm happy with the things that I have. I just wish that I could end up spending time getting to know somebody, you know. But is it necessary? I don't think so, honestly. Like, I feel like life, I'm more flexible in doing things that I want to and, and, and makes certain decisions a little bit better honestly for myself but I don't want at some point to start dating people honestly. like I said I won't be alone for the rest of my life so but it just makes it difficult because then I become super picky you know like I'm not the kind of person that is like oh I have to be doing everything together you know like I don't need to I don't like to do things together all the time I get bored I like having my own things going on if the person that I'm dating they want to have their own thing going on they can go and do their own thing I don't need to be doing everything together if I do everything together I think it would be very bad you know and it's not that I would not care about the person or I would not love the person it's just like I feel like doing everything together there are certain there has to be a balance and I realized that a few years ago I was with somebody and I got so tired of having that person around that I even told her, hey, you want to go and do that? Go and do that. I stay here. I'm not going to go. And they look at me kind of like, was like, oh my God, you don't love me. You know what I mean? I'm like, oh, Dios mío, why? Why have to deal with this? Um, so that's the thing. 
but I don't know. I mean, it's just been difficult to really meet people, and uh, I don't know what it is, honestly. And I know that I'm busy with life, and life takes priority. But at the same time, it's like I just wish there was at some at some point I want to meet people. I don't want to be like I need to start meeting people, you know. And it's just been difficult. I think also with the pandemic, it's a little bit more difficult because I've been concerned about getting sick and, and a bunch of other stuff. And uh, but I will say what I can do. I'm trying online dating and, and meeting some people, but I nothing has happened yet but I hope that at some point I can things happen but we'll see when that happens you know it's not going to take it's not going to be like immediately it's going to take time and um, yeah so let's see where it goes anyway that's all I got I gotta focus on driving because I have to get to work so I will make it to work on time but like I think I'm going slightly late but I will make it to work anyway peace everybody stay safe and I'll see you in the next video vlog. Bye!